What's going on guys? It's your boy John and Liquidator coming back with another video. So it looked like Coach Salson Siri set the record straight about what they need to do along that defensive line front to be successful. Guys, for this one here, we got to go all the way down to Texas. Let's get it. Let's go. <laughs> The Buffaloes are officially in Fort Worth, Texas. Boots are on the ground, and they are prepared to go out there to do what they got to do to get this dub, bruh. And it looked like Sal Sincere had a strong talk with the defensive line front. Now, we all know people have been questioning the offensive line and defensive line front, but make no excuses about it. We definitely got dogs, and we definitely got young men that can go out there and do what they got to do. One thing I will say for the Colorado Buffaloes to be successful tomorrow down in Texas, they have to protect the football and limit the turnovers. We just seen what happened to Nebraska last night. It's very unfortunate, man. But if the Colorado Buffaloes could go out there, protect the football, limit the mistakes, and most definitely protect Shador Standards, I believe they got a great chance in beating the sleaze off the Horn Frogs, bro. With that being said, I'm about to play a clip and come back with some commentary. Let's get Demanding that you get it right every time. Because when it comes to a game like this, or it comes to any game, and you go out there and you f*** it up, it's on you. You're costing your teammates, you're costing your buddies, your coach costing the city of Boulder. Some of you guys get out there and we call the call and you guys freeze. That's why I want pressure on you. That's why I want you to be able to react. That's why no matter what, when your number's called, you're going and you're strangling their throat. You guys got to get that in your temperament. You can't think, oh, I, I know that. So we're going on this trip. Coach has made things really, really nice for you. You got to get on that plane and you got to study your tip sheet. You got to know it like the back of your hand. You got to believe in what the man is telling you. There's a reason why he wears a gold jacket. There's a reason why Warren Sapp wears a gold jacket. There's a reason why Tom Brady has all those rings. And you know what it comes down to? It comes down to work. It comes out to being strong-minded, saying, Coach wants me to do this. I'm going to do this. Now, I'm going to tell you this. I got to so as you guys just heard in that clip there, man, South Sincere kept it 100, bro. When your number's called, you got to go out there and do what you got to do. Flat out, bro. Coach Prime worried to go jacket because he worked. Warren Sapp worked. Tom Brady definitely put it to work in. He got seven Super Bowl rings, bro. So you guys want to be successful, you got to go out here and work. This is a great mindset to give to these young men looking ahead of this game. Get down in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think about this. And, uh, yeah, man. It's only up from here, guys. Colorado Buffalo is going to go out there and do what needs to be done. They're a very disciplined football team, I can already tell. We just got to wait till Saturday for everything to come together, man. And I will be down in Texas. So if you see me, say something, man. With that being said, it's your boy, John the Liquidator, checking out of here with another video. And y'all already know how I'm rocking. Until next time, shake the haters off. I'm out of here. Peace sure. out. You cut you should have seen by now. Coming. Yeah, they talking about it. We coming. They doubting us. We coming. They, they saying. We coming. They think it's a game. We coming. I don't give a damn what they say. You best believe. We coming.